Upon arrival, the unit comes with a knee valve installed backwards for added shipping protection. First remove the knee valve by unscrewing the four mounting bolts on the unit. The next step is to install three brass pipe thread adapters into the knee valve as shown. Please note that these adapters are not supplied by Advanced Tapco. Use a wrench to tighten the adapters securely. It's now time to install the knee valve into the sink. First insert the knee valve through the opening on the sink as shown. Next, secure the valve on the unit with the nuts and bolts provided. Use a wrench to tighten. First prepare the drain for installation by applying plumber's putty as shown. Next insert the drain into the bowl and hold it firmly in place. Apply the rubber seal paper gasket and the locking nut provided. Ensure the locking nut is secure by tightening it with a wrench. Advanced Tapco supplies a K121 faucet with the sink. First install the spacer on the faucet and insert the faucet directly into the hole. Next place a rubber grommet, serrated lock washer, and hex nut on the rear side of the faucet. The hex nut should then be tightened with a wrench. First install a 3 8 MPT right angle adapter with a 3 8 compression thread. Note this is not supplied by Advanced Tapco. Screw the adapter into the back of the faucet and tighten it with a wrench so that the adapter is facing downwards as shown. Next, install a 3 8 braided flex hose to the compression thread end of the adapter and tighten it with a wrench. Now install the half inch end of the braided flex hose to the top adapter on the knee valve as shown. Please note the braided hoses are not supplied by Advanced Tapco. Use a wrench to tighten. Continue to install two additional hoses to the remaining adapters on the knee valve. We will be showing where the other ends of these hoses are attached shortly. Next we are going to install the tailpiece to the drain. First attach the nylon insulating washer to the top of the tailpiece and slide the lock nut over it. Screw tailpiece onto the drain as shown. Use a wrench to tighten. Please note that the tailpiece is not provided by Advanced Tapco. <music> to mount the unit, first install the Z bracket wall clip to your desired location. Securely tighten the bracket ensuring that it is level. Key holes are provided for additional mounting security. Carefully mount the sink onto the wall bracket as shown making sure it is firmly in place. We are now going to install the cold water supply. Note when facing the unit the cold supply is the hose on the left of the valve. 
Attach the flexible hose to your incoming cold water supply and tighten it with a wrench. The last hose remaining is the hot water supply which is located on the right side of the valve when facing the unit. Attach the flexible hose to your incoming hot water supply and tighten with a wrench. The final step is to install the P-trap onto the tailpiece installed earlier. First slide the locking nut onto the tailpiece followed by the rubber washer. Next place the P-trap onto the tailpiece as shown and securely tighten. Please note that the P-trap is not provided by Advanced Tapco. Now adjust the mixing valve. The mixing valve is located under the knee pedal. In order to adjust water temperature, lift knee pedal and insert screwdriver into slot located underneath as shown. Rotate screwdriver until desired temperature is achieved. 